Hi friends, this is Rose here and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a rose out of crepe paper. So I already have this um, strip um, folded into double. Since this crepe paper is very very delicate and we want a small size rose, um, so we're going to go ahead and fold it. I have this crepe paper here in front of me. It's about 48 inches long, and I this was a uh, this is a broad one, and so I don't need it that broad for this uh, project. So I doubled it up, folded it, make this entire 48 inch crepe paper folded into half because I want a little smaller size rose. Then you're gonna hold it from the center and make sure. Make sure that they're even on the end, hold it in the center and make sure this 48 inch crepe paper is all the way even. In the center part of it, we're gonna flip it, flip this over and make sure you get this shape. Now once you have this shape, all you have to do it is um, bring this paper over and then this side goes across right there and we have to follow this pattern all the way like this and that goes across like that again this is gonna go this way and this will go across so again so when you have this paper flipped off you're gonna take this side of the paper flip it over same thing, you have to repeat this process until you get to the end of the crepe paper. You will have to make adjustments along the way if your paper is not really aligned together. You can go ahead and work on that and just follow the process all the way through. Very, very easy, very quick and uh, you can do it with your students in the classroom. They're really going to enjoy working on this project. We are about more than halfway done. Trying to see. It doesn't have to be perfect, but it has to be done all the way through. So you flip this part over and then you take this part and bring it over. Okay, back again. Finishing up. Just a few more flips. A few more. So here you see, we're almost done. So when you come toward the end, just push it hard, which is, which is going to give us good um, layers for our rows. Now we're going to hold, we're actually going to hold both these ends and you can even leave it and take a look. And we are on the last step toward getting the finished product, which is our rose. So I'm going to hold, I'm holding these two ends together as you can see, but this one end I'm going to keep on holding in my right hand, lightly push this up forward. And make sure you are very gentle with it. Just be and take it up, see how smoothly it goes all the way up and you can see all these layers. And I am getting rid of lots of layers while I hold this in. And there you go, guys. Tons of layers. And what a beautiful rose. So, toward the bottom, you can um, just fold it, wrap it around something. Or if you have um, like twigs and twines, you can wrap them around those use a glue gun and put them around on there and you can you know put it in a vase or you can wrap them around on those so here's your rose guys easy to make so quick to make and they look so beautiful take a look and you can just uh, put them together put it on a card um, just for decoration purposes. So thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you liked my video. Thank you so much for watching guys. Stay tuned for more and until next time
Take care.